Hey guys, Christina Mason here. Um, first, let me apologize. I'm getting over re recent sickness, and um, my voice has been going in and out all day. And so I apologize if that happens during this recording. Um, but the topic I was given to do my critical thinking paper on is the gender pay gap, which seems to be something that is relatively normal, um, not only in the United States, but all around the world. And so what the gender pay gap is, is the difference in the average grossly hourly earnings of women and men within the economy as a whole. So what this means is that women typically make less than men do um, doing the same job um, or any job in general. Um, so it doesn't matter if the female has the education for it, um, doesn't matter if they have the experience, women typically just make less than men. And so on average, women make about 77 cents to every dollar that a man does. Um, now, in order to put an end to this social problem and to fulfill the social workers' social justice mission, there have been laws set into place um, to help end this. And the laws that have already been set into place are the Equal Pay Act, which was um, signed by President Kennedy back in 1963. And um, here, more recently, in 2009, President Barack Obama signed the Lilly Ledbetter Fair Pay Act of 2009. So before they, uh, whenever the um, Equal Pay Act was put in place in 1963, women were making about 59 cents to every dollar that a man was making. Um, so it has made some progress in the last 50 years, but it hasn't necessarily made the gender pay gap not be there anymore. So then um, in 2009, uh, President Barack Obama put into place the um, Lilly Ledbetter Fair Pay Act. And what this did was um, it actually um, reversed uh, the Supreme Court's ruling that a person only had 180 days to file a complaint about um, being having being a part of pay discrimination. Um, so that is something that they have put into place kind of to put the step in the right direction to end the social problem. Another um, act that uh, President Barack Obama tried to put into place is called the Paycheck Fairness Act. It actually um, was voted down um, in, the Senate, in the Senate by two votes. Um, and what this actually did was it was meant to close any um, loopholes that an employer had from the Equal Pay Act and would give equal pay to women. This is something that um, in my findings that uh, here in the United States that's something that President Barack Obama is wanting to put an end to. Um, he wants everyone to be paid equally. Um, and not be discriminated against based upon sex. And so um, the law that they are trying to put in place and they have put in place are the step in the right direction to end the social problem. Um, it'll be interesting to see what other laws are put into place in the next few years to end this. But like I said, these um, laws are actually the first step in order to put um, an end to the gender pay gap. So hopefully this is something that can be um, ended soon um, and then, you know, everyone will be happy. So thanks.